Okay, hey guys, today I'll be making a video on number guessing in Visual Basic. This is basically my first video, and I'll probably do the channel on Visual Basics tutorial and how to kind of stuff. If you have any questions, please have it in the comment section. And as always, subscribe for more videos. So here I have the form set up, guess the number. That's the LBL answer. It's basically the display. That's the number of guesses will be shown there. Number of games will be shown there. Average guesses will be shown here. Total guesses will be shown here. To um group box. And here's the text box, label, and your actual button to actually check your guess. Let's get to the code. So first I have declared these six variables. Make sure you have these. Short random, it's your actual random um, from the random class. And it's making a new random. And here is your short secret number. And that's going to be assigned to the value of short random dot next. And this, that is a number from 1 to 100. And short input is short. And that's your input, the one you put in. And that's the secret number it generates. Short counter total. That's the total number of counts. And short game counter. Short um how many games there are. And your game average. And that I, I declared as single because it's a decimal and it can be a decimal. I didn't declare the short counter for the actual game you're playing because it can get erased. It can get erased. And it's not total number of guesses for the total number of games you play. It's just the guesses for the specific game you're playing currently. Here, I put it in BTN guess, click event procedure. Like I said, I declared it as static. Make sure you declare it as static so it won't get run, so it won't go away every time you click BTN guess button. Um, so I have a try catch structure. Here, I set up the input and I convert the, so txt input dot text is um converted to short and is assigned to short input short counter here is going to be added by one every time you click the button and the it's assigned to lbl guesses which is right here in here short counter total the total number of guesses as you play games will be right here and that's assigned to this which i showed you already right there and here all you gotta do is just follow this part if it equals then um if they both equal then you guess it right it'll be the answer dot text it equals short input and it's correct and here I just added a bunch of colors if you want to you can have that um the code is pretty long so I'll probably put this in the comment section I'll put it in the description box below select case SHRT counter here it'll actually grade number of guesses you did. If you guessed less than three and got it correct, it says excellent. And if you guessed less than five, not bad. If you less less than fifteen or equal to fifteen, good job. But if you did more than that, you suck. I just have a little thing right here. If you suck, then I just had a little statement that makes your computer shut down. I wouldn't really use it if you want to. I just commented it right here. And select, and now LBL answer dot text will turn nothing. LBL guesses will turn nothing. Your back color will turn nothing, and your new number will be generated. Remember, this is all only when it's equal. Only when it's equal, all this is generated, and your new number is gets started again. And your game goes up by one. Um, your short um game counter is assigned to LBL games. If you're gonna don't mix up this code because it needs to be in this order. If you mix it up, then you might have some errors. Have this in this order. You can delete some stuff like color parts and stuff. But here I'm just changing them to nothing. So after your answer is it's displayed that it's correct, it'll just clear it out. Next, else if, if it's greater than, then it says it's too high. Else, it's too low, then. I'll just add another LB answer back color. It'll equal red. Back color here will be red. Here will be green. But yeah. 
and then that's it catch excess expression if you didn't do it like all the stuff if you didn't do it as above message box that's right you did not choose an appropriate render bbc or yeah and please try again inappropriate input and try that's it pretty much that's all it is and yep now let's actually test it uh... whatever cancel fifty fifty is too high seventy five too high oh oops why did I even guess that I don't know thirty thirty is too high zero zero is too low fifteen fifteen is too high seven too low ten ten is correct good job and then your game counters added your average guesses and your yeah stuff and then your new number number is automatically generated, so it isn't as the same. It isn't the same thing as ten. Ten is too low. Yeah, and that's it for this tutorial. And if you have any questions, have in the comment section and subscribe.